We are in the exploration business. We explore for high grade uranium in the Athabasca in Canada. We are actually the uh, second spin out from a company called Strathmore many years ago. So we're an 18 year overnight success. Well, it's a very difficult process. You have to have the right asset, the right working capital, the right team around you compliance wise. Um, it's a high standard that TSX has put out for companies to meet. And so you really got to have all your ducks in a row, but it's well worth it because it sets you apart from so many companies and around the world you can say you're listed on, you know, on the big board in TSX. So it's, it's a great uh, accomplishment, but at the same time, you've got to have the right, you know, the right pieces in the recipe, a great asset, a good management team, you know, the right uh, compliance people around you, attorneys and accounting. You've got to do all those things right, but it's well worth it. Well, we're going to continue what we've always done, which is make sure management's interest is aligned with that of shareholders. And being the exploration business, what we're doing is develop what's called a PLS project. It's a very high grade, open and pitiful uranium project in northern Canada and Saskatchewan. And for us, we've made the discovery, we've taken it so far, after two years of drilling, we continue over the next two, three years to drill that. Now, along the way, we may sell or buy somebody else. Um, that's part of been our uh, DNA from a long time. It's continued to grow aggressively and rapidly, and that takes a lot of capital, and we're very thankful to have good bankers to do that. Well, I think it's the only place to go, in my view, in the world, if you're looking for risk capital, especially for oil and gold and other commodities. Canadians know several things besides hockey, as someone would say, but also we know how to match money to good uh, exploration ideas. I think we're the best at it. Well, our goal is to continue to grow the one asset we have and, and one day probably sell it. Um, that's our end game. We've been doing this since 1996. We take a group of assets, take the main asset, grow it, sell it, then move it down all the way down the food chain. So our hope is to continue to grow it and hopefully uh, monetize this for our shareholders in the next couple of years.